Russell, I'd like to introduce the differences between the new 2017 CRV EXL and the 2016 CRV EXL. I'm going to allow Bobby to start right here. Go ahead. All right, Dancy, I appreciate it. So Honda kind of put some of their Formula One race inspired technology in this uh, CRV right here. It is a 1.5 liter turbocharged motor. It's the Ooh. first time they ever did a turbo in an SUV for Honda here. It's uh, 190 horsepower, um, 179 foot-pounds of torque with this engine here, and it even gets better gas mileage and has more power than the 2016 here. Dizzy, if you don't mind turning on the car, they also have these uh, shutters right here. John, if you don't mind coming up here and look at these shutters and see how they close up right here. This is gonna reduce drag and airflow and optimize gas mileage with this vehicle here. Uh, when the vehicle's cold, they'll shut. When the vehicle starts getting warmer, they'll open up again. So that's part of the Formula One racing inspired uh, technology there. And you buy it for that reason alone, right? Right. All right, thank you, Bobby. I'd like to introduce you to the new styling of the CRV, different from the SUVs of the past. CRV has gone completely to new in design. It's got a nine inch, water, nine inch wider body. It's a little bit longer. The new integrated headlights form with the body curvature. They've taken the time to put on the daytime running LED lights. The hologram lights from the uh, Touring CRV16 are now included on the EXL. It's got the all new open grill for the intercooler and the shutters that Bobby mentioned. The nice form of the body comes all the way down. You upgraded your wheels from 17 inch to 18 inch on the EXLs. You also have your integrated LED turn signals in the mirror. They've also gone to the lane watch uh, blind spot uh, monitoring system where it allows you to know when you turn your blinker on there's a vehicle in your blind spot and I bet you'd buy it for that reason alone. Hey Dizzy, let me talk to you about the seats for a second. So this, so Honda has the new seats um, in the 2017 version. It comes with the 12 um, seat, the 12, sorry, the 12 point powered seats on the new 17s. It comes with a four point um, lumbar support system. Same with on the passenger side, it's gonna come with a four point uh, power seating as well that that didn't come on the 16. If you wanna jump in here with me as well, it's gonna come with the, re, um, the new design inside interior. It's gonna come with the brake hold system, which wasn't in the 16. What that's gonna do is on an incre incre incline or declined hill, when you come to a complete stop, it's actually gonna keep you there. And then once you put your foot on the gas, it's automatically gonna take it off for you. Honda loves their customers, and so one of the biggest complaints was the volume knob in the 2016 that it wasn't in it. So this, what they're going to do, with, um, what they did with the 17 is they brought the volume knob back for you guys. Now, speaking of which, Landon, you have a beautiful um, setup here with the touch of the seven-inch touchscreen. You also have on this, you've got the they've added the uh, fan adjustment uh, buttons here inside rather than having to push the climate control like you had to in the past. You also, on this, have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. What that's going to do for you is it gives you, the, it gives you all the functionality that you, of the things on the phone that you would like to do, um, like calling, texting, um, having your maps up on the screen. All of that's going to be right there at your fingertips without having it being too much of a distraction. And I'm sure you'd buy it for that reason alone, well, right? Of course. Hey, so Landon and Jared here, I want to let you look at the back seat here. So Honda actually put in this USB fast charging uh, ports here. There's two of them for your kids. And we all know all of those real chips. We have those kids and their tablets. So they could actually charge their uh, tablets, their electronics right here in the back with these fast charging ports there. There's two of them there, one for each side there. Also, this is a 60-40 split uh, back seat, fold down flat. And they actually give you about nine inches extra of uh, uh, length on this here as well. That way you have that extra room, uh, whatever you need to put in the back, kayak, whatever, uh, tubing, some stuff for the vacation. Uh, we're coming to the back over here. So they got this mat right here to make this complete surface all flat here as well. And then this mat will actually move, make the bottom a little bit deeper. So if you have all your groceries in the back seat, this little lip right here, if those bags ever spill and open up, all your groceries won't fall out of that vehicle there. Also, Bobby, remember, you've got the height adjustment for your garage, so when you go in and pull in to go into your kitchen, if you've got a low ceiling, you can adjust the height of your door latch at the back so you don't hit your roof, damaging any of the beautiful features on the back. Also different is the push button close and open trunk latch. So when it closes all the way down, you'll notice you have the brand new integrated tail lights that confirm to the body molding of the vehicle. You have the standard spoiler on the rear with the LED brake lights. You have your LED brake lights wrap all the way around. Obviously, you have the beautiful Honda badging. If we make our way around, you can see that the tail lights flow with the form of the vehicle. 
All of the beautiful areas in the vehicle opens up the back space. The window's a little bit longer, so you've got less of a blind spot. Again, we're going to point out these beautiful 18-inch wheels on the Honda. Not only that, Dizzy, we have some exciting information. The biggest difference from a 16 CRV to this fifth generation CRV is going to be the inclusion of that uh, Honda Sensing package on EX trims and above. Honda Sensing Suite is a safety package and driver assisted functionality that ultimately helps the driver find those objects that they otherwise would have missed um, if they were driving on the road, keeping you safe and secure including your road departure mitigation system, your lane keeping assist system, your collision braking mitigation, and your adapter for cruise control with Civic inspired low speed follow. This vehicle actually comes to a complete stop if it notices a vehicle in city limits that's come to a stop at a traffic light, keeping you safe, secure, even if you get distracted. On top of that, we also have um, driver attention monitors when you cycle between this. This vehicle actually can uh, sense drowsy driving and lets you know visually and uh, audibly that you are drowsy and you need to pull over, so be safe, get a cup of coffee or take a nap. I want to thank you guys so much for uh, you know, letting us uh, walk around on this vehicle. The big differences between the 16 and the 17, this fifth generation, truly awesome. Here at Performance Honda, we'll put a smile on your face. Every customer, every vehicle, every day. Sensing.